Uh, my name is Levi Gorsuch. Uh, I own BBRL Hereford Cattle here in Junietta, Nebraska. We started in 2015, and when we started, we wanted to base our cow herd on cows that are balanced all across the board. Uh, Hereford can handle it all. They're hardy breed, and so that's why when I decided to sell my commercial cows and get into being a seed stock producer, I went with the Hereford. When I started buying Hereford cattle, I went to programs that had 50, 60, 70 years of proven genetics, like Holden Herefords in Montana, Cooper Herefords in Montana, Van Newkirk Herefords in Western Nebraska. I knew I could go there and find quality cattle to start our herd here in South Central Nebraska. We knew good seed stock breeders start with the cow first. And so when we choose a cow, she's gotta be balanced across all traits. That means she's got to uh, milk well, she's got to have good feet. We like to have lots of pigment on our cattle because we're, uh, we're at, you know, the Hereford handles all types of environments from the cold winters in North Dakota all the way down to the heat of Texas. We focus on producing bulls that are uh, predictable profitable and sustainable for our customers. A lot of our customers are commercial cattlemen that want to take a Hereford bull and put them over an Angus or Red Angus based cow herd to create the popular F1 Black Baldy and Red Baldy calf. We have a set of commercial cows because we like to show potential customers just what our bulls can do on a commercial herd. So you'll see we have some solid black, solid red cows that we breed to Hereford bulls to get the baldy and then we do keep some of our baldy heifers back and breed them back to black bulls. We want our bull buyers to have a bull that you know lasts them three, four, five, even six years if they aren't keeping any replacements back out of them and that starts by how they grow and so we feed our bulls like athletes you know we hand feed them so we know exactly what they're getting it also helps with the docility of them by being in the pen with them every single day and we don't feed our bulls hard we want them to develop on a high rough roughage ration so then when they go out to breed cows for our customers, they're not gonna fall apart and they're gonna be the same bull when they come in from breeding those cows that they were when they left our place. A bull that is predictable and sustainable, then that's gonna be profitable for our customers and that's our main goal. The cattle market's a high risk market anyway and if we can take some of the guesswork out of it for our customers, then we're doing our job right here.